Yo, what's going on, boys? We are playing a little bit of Pele here. And I want to go super Healy Pele mode. Super Healy Pele mode. I will need beads to get aggressive. I will also need a horn shard to get aggressive. Um, I could steal the blue. I could steal his blue, I mean. I don't know if I'm actually able to, though. That's the only issue. Like, his damage is pretty good, right? And since I started Soul Eater, I don't think my power is all that high. But I don't know. Maybe if I get a knockup, maybe. Because he's not going to start with his three. Or, I'm sorry. He's not going to start with his two. So I might be able to walk in there after his initial combo, get a knockup, and double, double one the buff and get it. Or I could be even safer, maybe, and wait for his second combo to come out. Because it takes about three com it takes two combos and auto attacks to kill blue buff is Chang'a. So maybe that. But either way, we're gonna go full life seal today. It's gonna be pretty fun. I have no idea where he is. There's no way you're doing red buff, right, dude? Who does red buff on Chang'a? Oh, I'm lagging really bad. Red buff Chang'e? Ah? What the hell? I've, I, I can honestly say I've never seen that. I've never, ever, ever seen that. And he started... Bro, red buff Chang'e? Ah? And he started no mana pots. That is crazy. Hmm. He's just going to give me a bunch of control early game. I mean, I guess he already knows like he's Chang'e. Ah, he's not going to win the early game, but maybe that's why he went red buff. Because he knows like you're not winning the early game, bro. Okay, never mind. He actually just demolished me. <clears throat> uh, it was the 400 damage from archers that did it, actually. Damn, dude. How did I die there? Oh my god. I don't know. Is it my mouse or am I like ping lagging? I can't tell. I might be ping lagging. You never know. You never know these days. Please tell me that kills backline. Doesn't. Right, whatever. Even beads his uh his alt stun and it did nothing. All right, let's go. Let's grab a Genji's here. And then after Genji's, we'll go full healing. Actually, is there a, a magical life steal or is there a magical defense item that heals me? No. Mail, mail of renewal. I guess. But that's technically not defense. I don't want one defensive item. Hmm. He's not backing. Waiting for that blue buff to spawn. All right. Now he wants that red buff. Nice. Perfect. Perfect, dude. The alt steals the red buff. And we grab the kill. 
So that first blood doesn't mean anything anymore. Let's go. That is so good for me. We back in this bitch, boys. Also, it's at the four minute mark, which means the treasure chest has spawned, which means it's spawned over by the XP camp. Um, the XP is not there yet. I think he's over there right now. I think he got both treasure chest and XP camp. Yeah, I need to stop him from getting the wave now. I need to make it bad for him that he came over here. I mean, I guess I kind of made it bad for him. I didn't kill him, but I saved one treasure chest. Oh, you are just dead. You are just dead. He is, uh, he's panicking a lot. I've noticed. And I, I'm sure he notices as well. But he's using his immunity when I'm not even stunning. Or, or knocking up. He's, um, he's popping that immunity before I'm even threatening to knock up. So... Honestly, he can win this game. He just needs to take a breather. He just needs to like sit down, relax a second. Let's get some more healing with serrated. Just a little more. And then I'm also going to be going. Um, I know it doesn't show here, but I'm going to be going Yotin's the lifesteal version of it because my passive gives me a bunch of healing and my passive would proc at the same time as Yotin's passive would. Like the glyph version of it, this one. At uh 50% actually. Mine is 30%, right? Oh no, mine's 50. Yeah, so it procs at the same time. And during that proc, I'm gonna be getting 20% healing. And then my my passive, which is uh 30% lifesteal. So that's I mean that's already 50% lifesteal. And then I'm also gonna be playing Aussie. Which is going to be giving me another 50%. So when I get to half HP, my healing doubles. And I'm going to have a lot of healing no matter what. But like doubling that healing is pretty nuts. But I'm going serrated first because, you know, penetration and whatnot. Yada yada. You can have the wave. I'm okay with it. No, he altered it. I wanted him to alt it. That's why I waited. I wanted him to come closer and maybe think that he could alt it, but I didn't think he would. I, I thought he knew that he couldn't get it with the alt. I was okay losing red buff. I just wanted him to get rid of his alt. Because that means bull demon is up. And he cannot fight me. Just so we're clear. He's nowhere close to being able to fight me right now. I mean, I guess it depends on how much damage I take from Bull Demon, but in my mind, this should be completely free. He has no long range way to take it. Yeah, my goal, my goal was actually get him to alt red so Bull Demon opens up because I can't do Bull Demon if he has alt. I'm not stupid. Lucky me, it worked out, though. Also, if you step up to clear this wave, I will kill you. Oh, I think he horn sharded. I'm okay with getting a horn shard there. I'm okay with getting the horn shard. Um, So something that was a massive change to Chang'a that a lot of people don't know is that Chang'a's 3 no longer has anti-heal on it. Everyone knows Chang'a's 3 is 50% anti-heal but they removed that a while ago so um, he actually has to build all the anti-heal in the world to stop me. I think I have enough for serrated. Actually, I kind of want to just wait. What is it? This is 2,800 and then that's 
I need like 700 more gold, maybe. I can wait it out. Minions already spawned again. I've never been less scared of anyone in my life. Nice. And I should have about enough. He thinks I'm back. I kind of want to go beat stick as well, actually. But I don't think I can. Alright. I tabbed out. I did not mean to tab out. Um, I mean, I don't actually get his bull demon or I'm sorry. I don't actually get his Phoenix. I do have 5,000 gold though. Which is pretty ridiculous. So let's go ahead and buy these items here. Buy that and this. And I guess we'll start our... Um, I kind of want to go Blood Forge here. Maybe I'll just go a 500 pot. Dude, that power spike. Holy shit. Finished Jotuns. Finished Serrated. 500 pot and tier 1 blood forge in one back holy crap you bet you better not show up if you show up to this bull demon you are dead as hell i mean unless you steal it with your ult in which case well played oh there you are Look at my healing. Look at my healing. Bro, I got 50% health and just healed everything back easy. Bro, I heal so much. Oh my God. <laughs> I heal so much. He can't kill me. Oh, so close. Ow. Alright, I do have my Blood Forge online already. So let's go grab that. The reason I'm going Blood Forge instead of Devos is because it's 50 power out the gate. And, um... So I don't have to stack it. But more, even more importantly, is the movement speed. Against Chang'a, I need... A lot of movement speed to deal with her. Dude, my one miss. That's cringe. I'm going to wait for red buff this time, I think. Oh, you're just dead. Interesting. Oh. Well, that might just be game. It's actually insane how far ahead... Um, it's insane how far ahead having sustained gets you, you know, like I, I didn't even necessarily win that many more fights or like crazy. At, well, I did out farm him quite a bit, but I was able to out farm him so heavily because I'm always at hundred percent health, you know, like if I'm holding a blue buff and I always have life steal, I'm always like topped health, topped mana, ready to fight at any point. And he just can't deal with that, man. That's crazy. Famer. GG Famer. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, boys, peace.